No, not that one. Shit. Flip camera. Mirror video. That's what we're going with. Which one, folks? Which one are we going? Ooh, that doesn't look great. Redeem your... What does that happen? Hmm. It's lunchtime live, folks. We got to open one of the Super 7 figures. Which one do we go with? What's up, ATG? Here, let's let's do this. Let, let's flip it. We got an hour. We got one hour. What's up, Chris? It's weird seeing your name. That's that's wild. <laughs> but here's the previous, some of the previous wave, not all of them. Previous waves, I should say. Hell yeah, that's the spirit. But, so we got some to choose from. Wingnut and Screw Loose, which you can see is probably the biggest ultimates they've ever done. Um, Zack the Neutrino. There's Duncan Dawn. You can see him. He's got the goggles. Any 2012 figures? <sighs> what a question, Jeff. Um, <laughs> I have a bunch, but, you know. Scumbug or Flocked Splinter? Which, which one are we going for, folks? Open the biggest box. A wild man. You're going, I like the way you think. Let me... Flip the camera back so I don't do not drop it. God, this is this is huge. I don't think y'all realize just how huge it truly is. Cause it's nuts. The purple one. The purple one is the only villain in the wave. Hold on, let me do this freaking tripod. Yeah, I'm not, I mean, it's not really heavy. Um, not, not bad. That's a lot bigger than it looked. Yeah, it's like it covers uh, your whole face up. So this is, this is massive. And like, if you know, if you know Super 7 Ultimates at all, these are like six, seven inch figures. So the box is huge, right? So let me put that there. Super seven. Wave nine. This one still has the slip covers. I know they're getting rid of the slip covers generally, but I think, you know, just because it's like an older wave, everything was all in production. So you, you do get the cool wingnut medallion, right? freaking nuts it's it's super glary so you can see yourselves a little bit but i think super 7 has the best display frankly like the the display on super 7 is wild and you have like they do the cool bio some graffiti the alternate head is crazy good it is it's like people are saying it's like batman so this is wingnut and screw loose dingbat buddies who bite the baddies <laughs> No credits, though. I would love for them to start doing, like, credits. You know? I think credits are cool. But. Here we go. Have you picked any of these up, ATG? Are you... I don't... I, I feel like I don't see a lot of Super 7 stuff with you. You gotta breathe in that fresh plastic aroma. Probably not good. It makes Whenever I do that, it makes me kind of lightheaded. Yeah, this thing is so massive. I can't... Insane. Insane. So... We got two trays. Yeah, this might be, oh, it's, all, it's all taped up.
one of the coolest figures ever produced. I'm going to say it. One tie, it looks like. Thank God. Only one. Wild. Wild stuff. I love that it's just the ties. Man, he, he's so big, they have like, they have like a little plastic tray just to keep his like feet in place. When have you ever seen like a foot holder? Yeah, ties, man. Neck has improved slightly, but their ties are generally the death of me. Come on, buddy. What is going on here? It's the strongest tie in the world. Some Super 7 reaction. Yeah, Ultimates. Once, once you get into those babies. Just don't break his finger in half. We're all good. We're all good. This guy is banana. Oh, he has like he even he has like a neck brace. What is that's crazy? Like I've never seen that on a figure. That has like he has like a neck brace. You have to pop that head off, I think. Look at that. That's insane. That this is insane. Oh, interest, interesting. There's a lot of interesting mechanics. Just don't break this figure in half. Yeah, that makes more sense. I should learn how to read. Like my, my God, look how big he is. Like next to Raph, itty bitty Raph. That's fucking nuts, man. That is nuts. Like, let me hold. Let me pull y'all in closer so you can get more of the magic. Like, that's that's wild. This is a wild, wild figure. And there's there's so much like crazy detail. The belt. That is, that's, <laughs> he does have like the cloth goods cape. I do like, I want to say like the fabric Super 7 uses, they had, I had a cloth good cape for like Shredder. And it's, it's wired of course, so you can do like the, the billowing in the wind, you know, and they did like some of the holes because a cape would get shredded. It's also like doubled up. Which is which is nice, so it's it's not as flimsy. But looks like we gotta put we gotta put the wings on our wing nut. Is he supposed to be Batman? I mean pretty much. He's he's basically Batman. These freaking wings. First of all, check that out. It's like a nice, it's like a, I don't know, like a tarnished metal kind of look. Utility belt is super rad. Like you can see, like here's his real wings and then he just, he augmented them. I think, oh my God, if you want to, that's nuts. If you want to do just like a bat wing, you can you can take them out. That's a wild touch. I was not I was not expecting that.
I, I didn't realize that was a thing at all. Let's see here. That's way cool. Toy of the year. Honestly, like this is going to be up there. So there's his like <laughs> rather sickly wings. If you wanted him to be like all natural. And then like they clip in, you can see there, there's like the holes. What's up realm? Realming it up. Are you there? Are you there? Huh? Yeah, and that's how you make like his big wing. That's cool. Like that is super slick. Did I do that right? This guy on there. Okay, and then you, <laughs> holy crap. Yeah, this figure is nuts. This is a nutso, a nutso figure, man. Like, that's, that's wild. And yeah, like the detail, the belt, the utility belt, like it's not glued onto him, which is nice. He's got like his little belly. <laughs> His pot belly. He's got, you can't really see, there's like shoulder pads. And that's what holds, like you can, um, you can actually like take the cape off. It just kind of clicks into like his shoulder pads, right? And nice little W's. Thank you for the gift, by the way, Landon. Thank you so much. So if you wanted no cape, you can see like like DIY <laughs> shoulder pads, like the phone. This, yeah, this this figure definitely going to be one of the best of the year, one hundred percent. Look at that guy, wild. So for the articulation, I would assume pretty standard. He could do the full Townsend, but his wing, obviously. Um, but pretty good range. Going about like that. Does he have a badass bazooka? Um, hold on. I see your bazooka. And raise you a ridiculous spear pistol. John Brown sending a gift. John, thank you. Thank you so much. Make sure you're following John, everybody. He's a crazy guy. But look, a spear. Like it's all the bat. I mean, the W. Come on. I'm pretty, is that? I would assume that's what that's supposed to be. Yeah, so not a bazooka, but you know, who needs a bazooka? That's wild. So, <laughs> and then he has single jointed elbows. They do have like a swivel, like we all have a swivel in our elbow. And then the fists of fury. Gauntleted, damn, man. Kyle Wadiga, he, he's the designer on these babies. I don't know who does the sculpt, but god dang. They killed it. And then, so there's, there's no ab crunch. There is a little bit of like hip movement, but it mainly goes like side to side. The legs... Kind of wild. This figure's nuts, man. He does have kind of like a 
a wolfy leg going on with that and like the ankle there. I think I wiggled it too much. I think you can do, I feel like different orientations with like the, or no, maybe it's just like a hole, like he has holes in his wings. Okay. Let's see the ankles. Ankles are a little stiff. Let's fucking manhandle that shit. It's a bit of a ratchet. Andrea with a gift. Thank you so much, Andrea. Very, very kind. I do like the ratchet. I like what how do we feel about ratchet joints, folks? John Brown had to send gifts. Well, thank you so much. You never have to send gifts. Your beautiful presence is enough. That's that's crazy. That's nuts. Get his his cape back on. Or hold on. So now that we've seen him, he has more. That is wingnut. It sure is. He has like a, a batarang, I guess, which is like very much a bat. He has... Is this a different attachment for his pistol? Like this kind of like, it's like a ray gun. It's got to be, right? That's dope. That's super dope. He's got... A much more... Sinister head? Like, this is more of like a I Am The Knight. Like all his, his veiny ears and the nose. So this... <laughs> this one's a little, little derpy. But this one, he means business. That's freaking... Oh, listening device? Yeah, it could be that too. I guess I'm more violent. But yeah, it could be like an antenna. Good thinking. Let's swap off. Oh, I'm popping off. He has like, he has his like extended neck thing. With the articulation there. But... There we go. Yeah, there's just like the standard like big old neck peg. Like how's that for terrifying? Man. How freaking cool. A little a little boxing. Yeah, this wing nut. If you had to only get one figure from this wave, you can't go wrong with this guy. I mean, my lord. Stand up Raph next to him. <laughs> like, they, like they're best buds. But... He has a bunch of these, like, batty, you know, gas canisters, grenades, as you like. He has, you're just going to get Duncan Don. Duncan Don is super cool. I'm really excited to get to him. Oh god. Did you see that hand go flying? That was a mistake. Gotta have a pointer finger hand. That's key. Man, the detail on the hands, too. Like, default Nux. 
He's got kind of two ponderous grabby hands. And then he's got the trigger finger hand where we can put in his supposed listening device. And it's looking all snazzy. Wingnut is just a mutated Batman. Pretty much. He, he might as well be Man Bat. I feel like I'm not getting this hand in there all the way. There we go. <laughs> that's that's wild. So he has that. Nuts. Nuts. But he's still got one more thing. His little buddy. Which they did do two ties. His little friend, Wingnut, or no, Screw Loose. What's my brain going at? I just can't stop thinking of Wingnut. Here's Screw Loose. <laughs> Where do you recommend you buy this at? Um, I think the only place it's currently in stock at is Entertainment Earth, um, which I don't really like shopping there because their shipping threshold is like insanely high. But, you know... I'm I'm a greedy fool, so I did the whole wave free shipping influencer code. I used Toy Bro. He's cool. Um Yeah, I mean I guess I don't know if people have big bad toy store discount codes. Um I don't think I've seen much of those. But I would check try Entertainment Earth and try to use like the Toy Bro discount code, or I guess you could use Chewy. Or pardon my nerd. No, he ha pardon my nerd hasn't read One Piece, so do not use his code. Fuck that guy. We only use codes of people who have read One Piece. <laughs> but add it to your cart. Try the code. Maybe pardon my nerd, but again, you don't you don't want to support that kind of guy. Uh, <laughs> his wings. I can actually, look, I can show you something to compare, but look at this. He has four little articulating arms, like no elbow movement, but you can move these all around, which is pretty nuts. Like up here, he's like, cool. This one, he's accusing you, ready to brawl. That's pretty wild. And then head swivel. The tail, but so you can stand. Can we stand him there? Why do you hate me? I hate you because you haven't read One Piece. If you would just catch up to One Piece, 1107 dropped today, pardon, and you can't read it because you refuse to catch up. You know, what do you, what do you, what do you want me to do? But look. Oh shit, I'm dropping all kinds of shit. Hold on. For comparison's sake, we have the Playmates Wingnut. And so here's here's the screw loose originally. So you can see they um pretty dang faithful. But they, they upgraded him quite a bit. Quite a bit. The, the little buddies, I love that they take the little buddies and make them into fuller figures. But we have here... Undo this. 
You're close. I mean, you're. Are you going to start reading it after you catch up in the anime? Is that what's going down? Oh God! I just popped his head off. What the hell? Okay. It's like here's a reissue of the original figure. So it's pretty cool. But you're going from this to this. That's a pretty that's a pretty immediate and massive upgrade. I will say The, the metal wings do kind of come off, but, like, that's nuts. Like, because, like, like, the details they take and, like, add to it, pretty crazy, like, making him bigger. I caught up. Now I need to find time to read. How? What do you mean caught up? How caught up are you? But, yeah, isn't that nuts? That's freaking nuts. This figure is mental. Absolutely mental. Man. I'm just, I'm so blown away. I think I cut myself. Like his, his feet are so big, you can like clearly read the writing. Where's this pointy finger hand? Ooh. This big old meaty hands. Oh, his fingers are sharp. Someone warned me about that, and they're not lying. That is incredible. This figure is wild. 10 out of 10. One of the best. Look, he's got like handcuffs. <laughs> Insane. This is Wingnut. This is Wingnut and his buddy Screw Loose. From TMNT. This is the Super 7 Ultimates line. I guess I should measure him, but he's tall. I mean, he's hunched over, but even then, he is freaking huge. But yeah, the wings on mine keep, like, popping out. I don't know if I just don't have them secured or pressed in enough, but... Jay is coming, the, the filthy scoundrel. Team and T3 lover, Jay. He, his name should really be Team and T 1990s. When did 90, the t third movie come out? 93? What do we do, got to do to get you to change your name to Team and T 1993? <laughs> Thank you for the rose, Jay. Thank you so much. Very kind of you. I don't know if I like the wings like all the way up. I could like flap him like he's like mid flight. Incredible. Incredible. The craziest figure ever. Whoa. Again, what is that? The big heart thing? Hand hearts? That one's, that one's I'm much more impressed by, because it's bigger. But you're wild. You're wild. Y'all don't have to spend money. I know Jay... Jay basically lives in a mansion, so I'll gladly take all his... <laughs> his money. What brand is this? This is Super 7. Um, thank you so much, Jay. You're a, you're a real peach. But yeah, this is... 
where, where is it? Super 7. Super 7. Yeah, the NECA one, the NECA one's cool. Um, I love the NECA stuff. But for me, I don't know. There's something about dropping everything. Um, the way Super 7 has taken these classic designs and like translated them into a giant figure is just nuts. Let me let's put the cape back on. The cape secures onto the shoulder pads like so. Let's do his his more retro head with like the crazy eyes. Freaking insane. He's got like the tongue. The crazy tongue action. I think I cut my my finger a little bit on him. Because he is a little sharp in parts. <laughs> that is just so sick. I wonder... I could probably... F no, I don't think that's meant to go there. I guess he would just hold it. Or maybe some gas canisters? Did we mention that he has Batman colors? Um, not specifically, but people have been asking. He's, he's I mean, there's, there's, there's no way he's not inspired by Batman, right? Like... He's a literal Batman, and there's there's no way they, that's not what they were thinking. If, if, if Playmates said otherwise, I would never believe him. Look, so there's his belt completed, putting the canisters in. Yeah, not Batman. This is third-party Batman. <laughs> Change up the gun. Just nuts. Away. Look at his, I like the eye, like it looks like he's like following him. Super 7 got to give us Pizza Face next. That would be super cool. Power Rangers? No Power Rangers. I have the Turtle Power Rangers. But that's that's it. Yeah, Pizza Face would be super cool. Um, though, generally, they seem to be shying away um, from retro figures, kind of, maybe. Uh, who knows? They are doing like Rat King. Wing Nuts. Yeah, this is a dope. That's a dope figure. Just a little buddy. Where's Screw Loose? I don't need this. You do need this. Think of the pictures you could take. I think the detail on this guy is really spectacular. Like, it's just, it's fantastic how they've done it. Yeah, a Batman crossover? Come on. That definitely needs to happen. And then again, here's here's Space Raph for, for a sense of scale. Wild. Highly recommend. Yeah, I think he was like 75 bucks. So he's pricey. But... If you ask me, I think he's totally worth it. 
Just, just a nutty fella. Man. Man. Like, you can even... Like, if we compare... He goes quite nicely. I mean... Robotic Rocksteady is freaking tall. But in terms of, like, girth... Wingnut is far girthier. Like, he can't even stand behind him. That's one of my favorite things about Super 7 is the scale on their figures. I think I, I think very few lines nail like the awesomeness of the scale. No chewing in the house. And there's <laughs> There's the original Wingnut. This is my Playmates reissue, so they really recreated this very faithfully, I'll say. Chewing prohibited. I mean, I'm not going to go there. But there's jokes. It's like, if he created an alt account, would it be like only swallowing? I don't know. I don't know. I'm just, I'm throwing it out there. If you need like a secret account... <laughs> I didn't say it. Two thirds of behind the plastic. Yeah, this is true. I like <laughs> wired capes, man. Wired capes. Like billowing in the wind. I will say, I feel like I don't have his hands in all the way. Zack is working. He would. He would be working. Come on. This is the kind of figure that I feel like even I could take a good picture of. Just because it like looks so cool. You're working. Wired caps, face plates, magnetic act ew, if he had if he had like a magnetic light up feature. That would be like chef's kiss level of awesome. Right there. That's a wild. That's a that's a wild dude. That's the that's the Batman head there. I'm sure it even has they did like like the texture I'm telling y'all y'all got to get into super 7 I know I know got the hater raid <laughs> We also have another big guy from the last wave was Genghis Genghis was good What am I waiting on? Jay is a big fan. Super 7 doing the 2003 Turtles. I feel like we should be seeing them soon. Um, they were saying that there was like another podcast appearance in like February or something. So I feel like maybe they're waiting for, you know, some love to this. Because I, I feel like the timing is usually like when, like, this wave had just come out, they, he did, like, Brian Flynn did a podcast appearance. So I feel like very soon we're going to be saying, seeing the 2003 Toidles. Um, which I think they're going to be stellar, because I love the way this Super 7 does the chonkiness. Um, they originally, they were talking, they've said before they planned to release them earlier, but, like, things got shifted around. Um, 
So I, I, I feel like any time it's coming. But yeah, what up, Johnson? Are you into Super 7, Johnson? I know, like, the price is an issue, which, you know, Wingnut is not going to help that, because he's, like, 75. Can you show the back of Wingnut? I certainly can. But I can give you, if you want... Oh, God, I have so much shit. Too much... Too little table is my alt account. Too little table. So there's his front. We got some belly for us. And then the back. He's got the cloth goods cape. Which I can, I can flip up. The utility belt, technically, you could swivel around if you really wanted to. Ooh, robotic rocksteady almost fell. One crazy thing is the wings, the metal wings come off. So if you wanted just like a really, a sad bat wing, <laughs> which is kind of wild. It's wild they went for it. Critical hit just got out of school. Badass. School's out forever. I think if we're if we're doing the belt properly, I think that should be the back of the belt. That makes sense. Cause he has like the rope and stuff there. Yeah, so you you do have to put the wings in. Should we see if I can take the wings out? Oh yeah, those pop out nicely. So just like the two slots. Clipped wings. Yeah, it's, it's interesting. I, I truly wasn't expecting the wings to be, like, editable. Just nice paint job. So, I don't know, folks. I think, I think 75 is totally freaking worth it. It's still a lot. It's, it's still a lot of bones to drop on a figure. But with like interchangeable pieces and stuff. So if you just want it to be like a crazy bat, bat blaster. He's in my cart. Dope. Yeah, I think it's, it's, it's tricky though. Um... Entertainment Earth, I think you need like $80 to get the the discount and free shipping. So maybe Big Bad Toy Store. I don't know if Super 7 still has it directly. You just opened your Scratch. Yeah, Scratch is really cool. I don't have Scratch out, but I love my Scratch. I think he came with the Mikey Wave, if I remember right. The Sewer Surfer Mikey. But yeah, this wave is nuts. I have I have the rest. But I've been we've just been, you know, slowly and laboriously gushing over him. Can he hold I guess the I guess this hand could hold like the bat thing, right? That's dope. But yeah, this wave is nuts. This wave is fucking nuts. You're hopefully... You get a decent Super 7 haul? What are you going to get? Yeah, there's just... There's something about, like, the size of Super 7 that I just... I don't know. No other line feels the same to me. And I think as you get, like for me, I know Jay, he likes his turtles vanilla, but I love when you start getting into like the wild and wacky variants. Which one should I open tomorrow, folks? My lunch line, my lunch line, my lunch time is drawing to a close, but let me show you what we have coming up and which ones we should pick. It's ordered right on. Show what's boxed. So we have here 
get, get you fellas out of the way. We have Zach the Neutrino. Pretty dope. I mean, again, I think this is clearly based on the Playmates Neutrino Zach. This is the best version of the Neutrinos. Cartoon Zach looks like a creep. I would kick him out. But yeah, he has like a metallic paint job, right? So there's, there's Zach. We also have... Ooh. Ooh. God, I have shit everywhere. That's what I have. So there's there's Zach. We have Scumbug. Which is wild. He's got like the toxic tank thing. This creepy bug thing. I mean, my god. Also super rad. Clearly Playmates. That's the purple one. Technically the... The only villain of this wave. We have... Shoot. Slam Duncan Don. How does Jay not love these variant turtles. He probably makes an exception for basketball, don't you? He's got the hoop. It's like the bow staff that can work as a stand for the hoop. That Don I do love. What is it about this one? It's Is it just because it's like it's not super weird or you love basketball? How does this one make the cut? You know? What's the, what's the methodology? It's the basketball. So, like, there is... Like, what about, like, TD, Toss, and Leo? If they did football Leo, does that do it for you or no? And then we have Wrestling Mike. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you're into, like, Rapper Mike, though. Rapping Mike. Yeah, you like Rapping Mike? And then we have The Last of the Wave... This one, actually, I think... Yeah, the, the Dawn looks awesome. This one, I, th I, I I'll be honest. I thought maybe this was a mistake getting... Because I have the regular Splinter, right? But, like, the flocked version... Vastly superior. Like, all furry figures should be flocked. Now, I know the flock eventually comes off, blah, blah, blah. But that flocking looks insanely good you know like man so i don't know what we got to start with i can't i'll probably save flocked splinter for last not gonna lie but i think tomorrow what, what do we go with tomorrow folks what should we open next it's the it's the downfall of the lunchtime live i'm a working stiff can i hold all of them Dare I risk it? This is ill-advised. Zach, all right. Zach the Neutrino it is. A good flock. Come on. I mean, come on. Like I'm a kid in a candy store with this stuff. There's your thumbnail. Probably will be, honestly. I mean... Kind of like a core. It's actually... They should do handles in the boxes. Or I guess I could do like... I spent a lot of money. 
I actually did. I bought the whole fucking wave, y'all. That's talent right there. Yeah, that's... That's why I'm a big time... <laughs> that's why I'm a big time influencer, folks. The amount of stuff I can cram in my hands. But Zach the Neutrino, look how smarmy he is. He's so smarmy. You just want to slap him right in the face. I don't know. I think Super 7's packaging is just the best. Because uh, apparently they're dropping in the future lines. They're dropping down just to this. Which I think is, is, is pretty damn amazing. If they added just like a proper hang tab, it's still too, probably too big, but man, like there's, there's just an awesomeness there. Wild, wild stuff. But yeah, I'm, I'm super excited to see the photos you're going to get, Chris. Everybody follow Chris. He does great photography. Don't follow Jay. Jay, um, hates fun. So don't follow him. Don't follow Pardon, we know why. But follow Chris. Just this is a nutty figure, man. Yeah. Though I do think y'all should make more like personal videos sometimes. I need to see like your rants. I need to see like a good old Chris rant on something. One thing that does, I'll say one thing that does kind of annoy me on this figure. Let me, let me show you. You can, you can pop the wings out. What's up, Spiral? So you can pop the wings out, which is cool. And the wings come off. So you have like this, which looks awesome. And the, the wings pop off. So you can do just like a regular bat wing. It is nuts. This wing nut. I'm f I, having it in hand. I'm fully expecting this to be some people's figure of the year. Though it's so early, you know. Will people still remember it at the end of the year? Probably. But that's a showstopper. But one thing. So like the wing has like a lot of cool detail. And there's like a peg hole. So you can, you can peg it back on. If I can show yes, like it goes just a little like that in the clip and then it kind of like tucks inside. So it goes back on. I wish this was a little more secure, though I guess, I don't know, maybe, maybe I'm just being weird, but, but it's cool that it attaches. Did he come with a little buddy? Yeah. I keep forgetting screw loose. He does have screw loose who does have some articulation because that that's one thing super seven's done um like they did they did the same with like, like ray filet and fish sticks Muckman and joe eyeball whenever there was a little buddy they added like they they add some like articulation to him like this one his arms move about if you want them to. I don't have the NECA version though. I almost bought it once in store. I've just never, I've never gotten huge into the tune line, you know? Playing some Fortnite. Yeah, I need to. I bought like the Shredder Battle Pass and stuff, so I need to grind out the rest of that. Your mom. My mom joined. <laughs> My mom, your mom's on TikTok. Your mom joined, I guess. Uh, five minute warning. God damn it. Okay, now we're back. We're back. You just got Super Shredder. Whoa. You're cruising through. Is it just purely experience you need for the battle pass? You went with Super 7 because it reminds me of the Playmates more. Yeah, I mean, it's... The Super 7 one is just directly Playmates. So, like, if you have... Here's the little buddy. 
that Playmates used to do. And this is the reissue. Take care, Jay. Yeah, I'm, I'm out in like five minutes, so soak it in. But thank you so much for the gifts, my friend. Everybody follow Jay, but at least leave him mean comments on his profile. Harass. <laughs> it's ooze from the quests? Okay. Yeah, because I've been doing like the... how You can get him... You can already go through all of it. I thought it only unlocked a bit at a time. Like there's like stages, right? Am I... Or do I just not know what I'm doing? Which is very possible. But yeah, so here's the little buddy where they just did like a, a one color plastic guy. Oh, not the Krang. Oh, see. So it's for the it's for the whole like Krang back bling. Okay. But yeah, so they, they take him and bring him into like a real figure, which is rad. And then here's the here's the Playmates reissue wing nut. So I look, I think I happen to put like the right hands on him. So it's like you go from this guy where the sculpt, like the details are all there in the sculpt. And then they, they make it into this, which is bananas. You unlock the entire battle pass, but you got to do the quest to get Krang. Okay. And the Krang is just like a backpack, right? He's not like a full character. You just strap him on there. That's not bad. That's not bad. Yeah, I bought... I think I bought all the turtle stuff except for, like, the instruments. Because I don't really care about the instruments. But I think I bought... Like, I have the four turtles for sure. And then I did... Um, Spl Shredder, Splinter. That wing popped off. Hey, yeah, you can see. Like, they really they brought this thing fully forward. April. I bought April too. I've been playing. You know what I like in Fortnite? I don't necessarily like the main Fortnite game a whole lot. Um, but I have been enjoying like um, the user created levels. There's this one where it's like you're on a yacht. You're just like on a yacht battling people to the first one who gets to 40 first. I really enjoy that. That's how I'm grinding out like the ooze thing. For the second part of it. I do need to try out the Legos too. I haven't done the Legos. Gun game. Yeah. It's like yacht. You're on it. You're just on like a, a big yacht. I just. I think that's way more fun. Just because it's like. More immediate. You don't have to wander around the map. For like 30 minutes. Before you run into someone. I wish they could have. Done a Krang in a mech suit walker. Instead of two shredders. That would be cool. I mean, I guess they could always do more, I guess. If, if this has been... I assume this has been wildly successful. So if they want to come back and be like, now everybody buy Krang. Why not? Because it just... It prints money. Is what it does. But yeah, this... This wingnut figure, definitely 10 out of 10. You're welcome, Chris. I'm happy. <laughs> Thanks for joining the live. I hope you enjoy it. If you don't enjoy it, Jay will refund you. You heard it from me. But yeah, take care, my friend. Have yourself a lovely day. You need the rest of the turtles, but you're broke. It's a lot. I don't... I like the turtles... I don't know if it's because like the turtles is like 30 bucks. If you get April, it's like 35. So like you're, you're basically in like 40 for the turtles. Yeah. See you, Chris. Everybody follow Chris. Um, excellent pictures. And he'll soon have pictures of this guy in all sorts of mind blowing ways. But yeah, like I don't necessarily think it's worth it to buy them all. Um, you only need super seven Leo. So hopefully I get that for my birthday. Yeah, I really love the Super 7 Turtles. I think I think the Super 7 Turtles are way fun. Um, so yeah, um, obviously I'm kind of all in on Super 7. Though I don't have all the older waves. But pretty much everything after Wave 5... 
Wave five, I think. Um, um, I have everything, so. There's, there's both of his metal wings. But yeah. So, oh shit, I'm losing track of the time. Um, I do have to go, sadly, folks. Thank you so much for joining, by the way. Um, it's always super fun hanging out, hearing from y'all. Um, tomorrow, where did I put him? So we did wing nut. Tomorrow, stay tuned for Neutrino Zach. Super cool. We're only six people doing relax. No, it means a lot to me. If I could have any six people in the world, I'm glad I have y'all. You like having options? I would say buy two turtles or something, you know? You don't... All four? Eh. You have to pay for a Super Shredder guitar? That sucks. Yeah, I think I bought the Shredder Battle Pass. So yeah, I'm like 60, 70 bucks in the hole for freaking turtles on Fortnite. I guess. I don't I don't think it's necessarily worth it, but whatever. Um, you wanted Super 7, but NECA Movie 3... TMT3 movie four pack. That's an excellent four pack. Excellent choice. TMT3 is the best movie. But yeah, sorry folks. I do have to go. Thank you so much for joining. Please stare into the mesmerizing eyes of Wingnut. Take care of yourselves. Love you all. Bye. Wait. Mm -hmm. Buy them all. I did buy them all, but I kind of regret it. But yeah, see you guys. Guys and gals.